What's up, y'all? It's your boy, Drum Killer. And today, we'll be talking about the staff. Pebble Cleft Spaces is F-A-C-E. And for the lines, it's E-G-B-D-F. For base cleft lines, it's G-B-D-F-A. And for the spaces, it's A-C-E-G. Now, what I use to remember treble cleft spaces is F-A-C-E. And what I use to remember the lines is every good boy does fine. Now, for bass clef, I use good boys do fine always for the lines and all cows eat grass for the spaces. Whatever you choose, it's up to you. What I use doesn't have to be what you use. You can use something like every good boy does for or something. Just, it could be unique to you. All you have to do is just remember. So, musicians use outside spaces and ledger lines when notes are too low or too high to be written in the staff. For example, the G above the staff is a space, and the, G, and the D below the staff is also a space. Now, the note above the G above the staff is an A, which creates a legend line. If you ever wonder how to read music over the staff, check out um, G over uh, the staff for treble clef. So, G to A goes... Uh, no legend line to legend line, which is a middle. And then A to B goes from middle to under. And then C, middle uh, to under. And then you have D that's under, under. Legend lines over the staff, it's a pattern. So it's middle, under, middle, under. Then just like B is under, but this time it has another under. The same thing for under the staff. Like when you have D for uh, treble clef, you have D, then you go to C, middle, then you go to B, over, and then you go to A, middle, over, and then you go to G, over, over. So it all follows a pattern. 